you think is holding companies back? It lacks often sponsorship from the top. The CEO needs to understand that there needs to be a single customer view and there needs to be integration between systems. And a lot of the time it's acceptable not to have that. And I think there's bigger problems and usually what's driving the CEO's thinking is, is revenue and bottom line. It should be a little bit more tech aware and data aware. I think the average CEO and then the change will flow. Directors um, of businesses in Australia need to be aware of data, security, cloud infrastructure and how that works. And then what the future is going to be like for your company with regard to technology, as opposed to just expecting it to stay the same kind of business forever. I think it's tying it back to those business outcomes that you'll be able to achieve by having that. Often it's not clear on what the business benefit is going to be, how like quantifying how much the organization is going to say, what is the impact of increasing that customer lifetime value? What benefit is that going to have to the organization? So it's, it's very important to have that clear strategy on what it is you're trying to achieve having the goals in place along the way so i think again that's why it's really important to bring in bring in partners to help create that you can't expect like individual organization people to just have the skills to know how to do that you really yeah. need to sort of i guess rely on people that do this all day every day to be able yeah. to guide you through that and know how to build that business case for you and show those quantifiable uh, benefits from having things like a single customer view there's a lot of redundancy happening in the lab force, especially in the tech sector. You see 10,000 people lost their job at Facebook. All of these large companies are tightening the belt because we're going into a recession. Everyone sees it coming. So there's a real need for people that maybe had traditional jobs to reskill in the tech space. There's also a real need for organizations to have people internally that are reskilling. So I think the, the answer for anyone in in any industry is to start reskilling into technology if you haven't already. Every business leader should accept that the world has changed. You know, they can't rely on business status quo anymore and we all need to level up, right? And the recession is really putting a spotlight on that in terms of how we need to focus on the digitization.